Day Q fam. Hey Day Q fam. Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back. So we're back with another video yeah. and as you know Mondays is mm. series days yeah. and in January we're on this series of talking about new beginnings. Yeah. And new beginnings is all about having a fresh perspective. Yes. Sometimes we don't actually need to change the circumstances. Yeah. We just need to change our perspective. For real. 2018 guys we're all the whole Day Q fam. Yeah. We're living our best life. We're going to be the best versions of ourselves. Can I get an amen? Amen. Man. Let's do this. So, if you haven't checked out part one and two, yep. they're both linked below. The first one was about leaving things in 2017. Snapping. The second one was leaving, no, no it's about changing, changing your, your mind. mindset. Yep. yep. And in this one, we're speaking to the singles. Yes. Those of you who are single in 2018, you're going to enjoy it. You know that. 100%. Look, why is it that some people who are single are walking around like singlehood is a disease? Seriously, I've had enough. Enjoy had your enough. singlehood. Literally. Say, uh, being single is the best, guys. Like, it's so good. I is mean, it? obviously marriage is you, good you wanna, too. You want to go back to being single? <laughs> no, marriage is, marriage is great too. Look, basically, what Annabella's <laughs> trying to say, although she's excited, is that in every season, yeah. there is a blessing. For and right. then there's things that you need to work out. Yeah. But what you, what most people do is focus on the thing that you need to work on yeah. rather than looking at the blessing. So when you're married, there's blessing. Yeah. When you're single, there's it's blessing. So it's all about your perspective. Yeah, because when you're single, you tend to think that like, being married is the next level of yeah. achievement, but it really isn't. Like yeah. both seasons have their blessings. So in this video, we really want to encourage single people yeah. to live their best 2018. Yeah. Single in a, like whether the bay comes in 2018 or not, yeah. you're still gonna have a great life. Exactly. So we just want to set talk about how you can have the best 2018 as a single. Let's get it. Are you subscribed though? <laughs> if you're not, don't think you can carry on watching this yeah. video. Get out of here if you're not subscribed. You need to move. I you wish YouTube could kick you out yeah, if you're not subscribed. Check button. You just Literally. fly out your house. <laughs> <laughs> but let's get into the video. So, the first way that we can be happy and single in 2018 is by remembering that being single is actually better than being in an unhappy relationship. Boy, oh tell me gosh. if you know someone like this. Yes. Someone who's willing to give up their singlehood just to be in a relationship. Yeah. They'll give up everything. To, for anyone. Yeah. You can have legs and that's <laughs> the only criteria that they yeah. have. There's no initial conversation yeah. on how you know where you're going how it's gonna how work how it's gonna work it is more like oh like you know yeah. we like each other yeah, that's it no, no that is not going to be us in 2018 mm -hmm. because literally a relationship is hard enough like me and Gabe we feel like we did all the qualification yeah we you know we're both purposeful we knew our identities individually yet yeah. we still struggle like it, it, the struggles are real so imagine how much more so when yeah. Is when you someone, don't really you get even, to know each other yeah. before you get in a relationship. You just go into the relationship because of desperation. Yeah, 100%. I can't imagine how and, hard. And even the worst thing is when you forgo your singlehood because mm. you're chasing marriage so much that to the point where you don't even get to know yourself. Yeah. Because you're right now single and you're just there looking at social media, yeah, yeah, looking yeah. at all the married couples, yeah. and then you just forget everything. Yeah, not even working on yourself. Yeah. And then you just want to put yourself as a baggage to someone else. 100%. And they're asking you, like, what's your direction? What's your career path? What you thinking you, you got nothing know. you're just there like, my criteria was i was waiting for yeah i was waiting for you like no, no guys literally in order for us to have healthy marriages and relationships yeah. we need to be healthy single as well and actually have a criteria of what we're looking yeah. for in a man and, and not have standards. compromise yes. our standards and our and our belief just to be in a relationship yeah. at the end of the day you don't want to be in a relationship or married and regretting that you mm. didn't put, do everything that you wanted to do in your singlehood yeah this is your opportunity 100 percent so what we need to do is remember that being single is a blessing it's yeah. so good if no one has come that is worthy of you then be happy and be thankful mm. that i haven't settled for less than the best exactly. and move on another way to be happy and single in 2018 mm. is by being spontaneous Mate, literally you can do whatever you want when, when you, you want, want without having Call nobody, tell nobody, ask yeah. nobody. Or put it in a calendar, oh my day. mark it as games <laughs> so that she knows that it's not me and her. Or ask permission and be like, babe, I'm thinking of doing this or spending this, is that alright? No! You can do what you want when you want. You can do spontaneous coffees, you can like, someone can call you and you can just chat for like hours. Mm. Oh my god. Or you can actually get on with your job. <laughs> Let me tell you. Oh, you want story time? Okay. So last week, yeah. Wait, hold on. Move out my way. Hold on. Look, let's have some games time. Look, last week, 
and I had the most difficult week <gasps> at work, okay? No, you have yeah. to accept it was hard. Yeah, yeah, it was a difficult it week. It was for you. proper hard, mate. But obviously. Can I just like in the tunnel, please? No, 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 this is games time. Look, so, so Anna had a very difficult week. Yeah. And who did she call? Me. I'm on my desk, my phone <laughs> rings. And I have, I have an Apple Watch, by the way. And this rings, I have a Fitbit as well. They were both ringing <laughs> and my phone. And I go to the meeting room, I call them, like, hey babe, what's up? <laughs> You just hear it. You just hear it on the phone. <laughs> break it. I'm like, okay, babe, what's wrong? Oh, that's oh, babe. Okay, sorry. Anyway, and then I'm like, what do you need? Do you need prayer? Okay, dear Jesus. Okay, <laughs> and then I can go back to my work. It wasn't just once. It wasn't just twice. I lost count. And on my lunch break, one whole hour. <laughs> just, just strategizing. This is what you need to do, babe. After work. From 7 to midnight, we were chatting about this work situation. I forgot who I was. Anyway, come back here. But basically, what Gabe is trying to say is that when you're married, you're distracted by the affairs of your household. Like, look at this. He probably had plans that week. You I know, did have to, a, to, a, a few plans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but I, need to I trump those. everything yeah. because we're married and... That's the distractions that come with being married. But when you're single, mate, you live your best life. You think if I was single and someone will call me and I'll pick up my phone at work? No way. Yeah, no but chance. Because it's the wife. Yeah. And, you know. But back to Lord. being single. <laughs> back to being single. Basically, just enjoy being spontaneous. Enjoy, like, taking risks. Enjoy spending your money yeah. on what you want. All of these no, things. No, no, you can still save. Yeah, you of course save. save. But, you know, you can just backpack by yourself. You can do all these things. Yeah. That There's you, so much to yeah. do. So we can't just be in a position where we're just idolizing marriage. Yeah. Marriage is a good season. But that season will come. Enjoy your singlehood. Yeah. Enjoy just doing what you want to do literally another way that we can be happy and single in 2018 mm. is actually by being selfless 100%. oh my gosh you see the thing is the world sells us lies yeah. all the time mm. and what the world says is in order to be happy you need to focus on yourself yeah. but the thing is when you focus on yourself you start to realize the insecurities yeah. you start to realize what you don't have mm. you start to realize that you're not happy with the way they are you yeah, need to go yeah. to the gym here it's like a bottomless it's a, pit it's an endless cycle mm. so, but sometimes the most important things taking attention off yourself yeah. and something for us that we love doing even now is serving in our local yeah. church when we serve in church we realize that there's a bigger picture oh, that life life is not all about games and animals yeah. there's more to life yeah we're building something bigger yeah. we're part of something greater and we actually only play a small part in that mm. but then sometimes when you're so fixated on yourself you think life is all about you yeah. the, the world revolves around you oh everyone can see that i'm single oh this person made a point and it's because they know that i'm single when actually <laughs> like no one cares. Yeah, it's, like, not no one, it's not about you. Yeah. And I think that being selfless actually takes the attention away from yourself yeah. and onto other people, which and is what life's about. 100%. And we can't forget that it's also a blessing to be a blessing to mm. someone else. And you actually get a sense of fulfillment by yeah. helping other people. And it gives you a reason to keep going. Yeah. But sometimes, yeah, when we focus on ourselves, we don't see the blessing yeah, sometimes. Yeah, 100%. And actually practicing selflessness before you're in a relationship helps you when you get into a relationship. It because does. mate like, you know like last week when i was being selfless oh yeah oh yeah you know you. like today when i was selfless for helping you do what a lot what stuff what mm -hmm. okay yeah basically <laughs> marriage is all about being selfless and if you haven't practiced it while you're single it's going to be even more of a yeah. challenge for you in marriage because marriage again is not about you yeah it actually it's about is. what you could do for your partner mm -hmm. and as you both do that you're both going to be fulfilled yeah but nowadays people are like you got to do this for me you yeah. got to do that for me i'm not going to do it until you mm -hmm. do that and then they start bickering the marriage yeah so literally practice selflessness when you're single not with the intention of like oh i'm going to be more self not with the goal of it being better for you when you're yeah, married exactly. but a, an overflow of you being selfless is that it will help you yeah. when you do get married it will so, come back to you yes. press down shaking together stirring. Yes. So we have to remember, let's not despise our singlehood. Let's yeah. be empowered to actually seize the moment yeah. and to live our best life. Seriously. And if someone comes along the way, so be it. If he doesn't or if she doesn't, so be it. Yeah. At the end of the day, 
marriage is not the end and be all yeah. it's a beautiful thing but at the end of the day we can't compromise everything just to be in a relationship yeah no way i think that singlehood is such a beautiful season and if everyone spent time really enjoying embracing learning that season it will benefit all the marriages we wouldn't have a 50 percent divorce rate yeah, that we exactly. have right now clearly something's not right with marriages so if we can all take care of ourselves in our singlehood mm. marriages will be better people will be better the world will be better and that's what we're about you know seriously you so don't know. let's do this and literally singles live your best life in 2018 like understand yourself be selfless serve in your local church do what you gotta do be spontaneous one minute you're on thailand one minute you're okay, bye. let's do this people Peace. see you guys bye don't forget to subscribe yeah